Welcome back my comrades, I am Victor Barisov and today we're continuing Fallout 76 playthrough day 68 now and in this one we're going to continue rebooting the system out of its program and then see where we've got to go after that guys. So let's have a look so let's make sure I am recording, yep green light is on, my voice has been picked up so I think it's perfectly fine so let's get into Abby's bunker. I did do a bit of teleporting when I ended the last video. By the time you see this one, it'll be on Friday, I believe. Or Monday, I'm not sure which one. But either one, yes. So I did a bit of teleporting to get here and the rest. And now we're going to explore this lovely little bunker. So let's go into the bunker. Let's reboot our system. Bad roach, bad roach. Let's break in and uh, reboot. There we go. So that's the first day of one done. So at the fourth frame we've got a level up combat armor leg. So let's see what we've got for completing the free state. Flame for our Tesla R Radway light combat trousers. Why is it telling me to go to that one? I'm nowhere near that plan. Yeah, thank you. Go away. Flame for our trap, light combat legs, and Tesla Arch. Nice. So we need to go to Camp Venture. I'm just going to teleport to this one. I know it's going to cost me a bear cap, so I can easily make back all these caps lightning fast due to the fact uh, I've got a ton of chems now from the last video and I'll just sell all of them. So as long as I keep finding chems, medicine, and weapons and hand grenades, I can sell to vendor bots. I'm perfectly fine, basically. So that's going to keep me in the stockpile for a very long time. Valve Angler saw the first deployment of the advanced T-51 series of power armor. So let's explore this lovely little camp then. So this is the military Brotherhood Steel Camp Venture, so survivalists ground. Yeah, we can tell the Brotherhood Steel's a giant logo on the wall there. Hello, ghoul. Let's take you out. I know that main building we've got to go in in a bit, so I'll do that one last. Once we've searched everywhere, medics, mirror, mirror. Let's try this old guard tower. Nothing much. Yoohoo, gooly. Sit down. Let's try this old knackered bunker. Oh, there's a note here. Goodbye, Appalachia. I remember the night we first arrived, half frozen to death in the blizzard. Teeth chirping, these cabins seem like one of those resorts you see on television. Those were tough times, but the cabins were home. Some holes sprung in the roof, we got a bucket. I beamed, fell down, we propped it back up, but the plaudents say they're just falling apart to keep fixing. 
It's going to be cramped in the new space, but it'd be nice to have four good walls and a roof. But I'll miss my time in the bunker, bunkhouse at Latcha. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Survive this packing checklist. Uh, who with you? When do you plan to return? How? Okay, this is just an of how to survive an apple when doing survival training. Hopefully we don't have to do any survival training because I'm pretty sure we're pretty darn well armed to be before we do any survival training. So don't need to go on that one yet. I'll go into that tower though. Medical station. That's another survival list planning checklist. We don't need a list. God, this tower's a bit faulty. Uh, grenade box. Yep, let's break into it and see if we can find any grenades. Yep, here we go. Dun, dun, dun. So we're going that one a bit. Medical kit here in this half destroyed shack. Uh, anything around here? Nope. But we are getting shot by, looks to be scorched. Stay down. So this is the main camp where we came in before to do the cargo bob mission, but I wasn't going to explore it. But now we are going to explore this entire area. But first we'll just take out everybody who has a gun and can shoot us. You're the ringleader, so you're getting taken out straight away. I didn't mean to pick up any of them. Because missiles and grenade launch shells seem to weigh me down a lot, so I'll probably drop them off somewhere later on. Hello? Oh, bro, how's your power armor? That's always handy. Come here. Come on. Let's have a look. What's in this broken up shack? Anything of value? Nope, just broken up shack, right. So this is their engineering area that looks at. Not much there, 245, some dead ghouls. Calibrated shocks. Can I actually use them on my, this one? So I can put calibrated shocks on this, this would be amazing. You cannot exit your power armor here. I should be able to. So let's have a look. Jump out, hopefully I will not get attacked. Uh, why modify and repair? Optimized braces. Need adhesive. Calibrated shocks, yes. Oh my god, that's gonna give me plus so much carry weight. Oh, left leg, right leg, right. So I can actually put them. Optimize brace. Reduces action points, costs of power attack. Okay. And the main torso, I definitely want to try and find a jetpack. One just lying around. But if we can get calibrated shocks later on. Oops. That's gonna be pretty cool. But for now, I just want to just drop this ammunition I've picked up. Why didn't we pick? Plasma cartridges. Plasma cores, missiles, any other type of rubbish ammo I picked up I didn't need, oh, that I definitely don't need. Grenade launcher rounds, I don't need them, don't need cryo cells, I don't need the flare fuel because I've got a load of that in my stash box, so yeah. Anybody finds that mag before I log off this world, then I'll mull them to it. Just the fact it's just going to weigh me down, it just takes up too much room in my stash box as well. Right. So search this area. I think the few hall tips are in here as well. About the place. Can you put a cup? Uh, super stimmy. Message one, message one. Let's Arch. listen. I keep recording these. Hoping one day I can make it home. I found these Brotherhood of Steel guys outside of Grafton. Now I'd heard about them. Be a million miles. 
miles further. I need a... I need a unit. A place to belong. I feel like the Brotherhood may be heaven. Interesting. Unless say someone's already been in the armory before me, because that door's normally locked. So I'm assuming someone's already broken to the armory and took all the good stuff. Yeah, and that safe's locked as well. So yeah, looks like someone's already looted most of the good stuff that's normally lying around. But oh, there is some plants here. Deep pocketed robot armor chest piece. Nice. Uh, so I left them plans there, so that's always handy for me. Alright, let's go and listen to the next holo tape. Then I can read the notes, then we'll read the rest of the whole tapes. Mark. It's been a couple of weeks. I've had three squares, showers, working lights. Oh, Camp Venture's got power. Proper power, Marge. I'd feel almost human if it weren't for the senior night in the training. I graduated basic easy back in the day, and I know I may be a bit softer, but Wilson's an army ranger. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, there's some flying bugs there. Hopefully they leave us alone. I'll leave that ammo box. Let's check this. Shelly's letter. I remember how Chris you said I was to join with the Bro of Steel. Can't mention how you said I wouldn't be able to hack it. That I quit within a week. Well, I'm right to tell you that you were dead wrong. This is where I belong. Side by side, the people who give crap about the world. Senior Knight Wilson treats me like I'm important. Like... I mass something you never did. I will find my corner and now knock one home. The Brojo steals my family now, Shelly. Okay, let's deal with these flying bugs. Is that it? I know there's more than one he is. Yep. Dead. Alright, let's go back into this camp then. Oops, fell down too much. Alright, we'll go back in. Read the journals, read the other notes, and then we'll go into the main shed there, see what there is, and everything like that. Uh, so while the journals was over here somewhere, here it is. Anonymous diary page. Uh, I bid my time and bit my lip. I joined the service of my on my birthday, and it was the proudest day of my life when I became a ranger. I all, I'm almost proud as I want to be in the tackle tree for Tardis Thunder. And now, Squire Knight Paladin, what the hell? I'm not to roll my eyes. I try not to let my un unit down, but sometimes on watch I think about leaving. Pick that direction and think west. Things got to be better at west, but I know too well what waits out there, so whatever stupid new rules comes, I'll bite my lip and say what they want, but in my heart I'm a ranger and not the Lieutenant can take that away. Okay, I think there's another page here. Yep. Uh, I'm starting to f think coming out to Camp Venture was a huge mistake. That these people are total nuts. Did you know they call themselves Knights and Paladins? What the heck is going on around here? I feel I joined the Brotherhood of Steel. I could learn to protect you and the kids, but all they want to do is create soldiers who are ready to die in battle. Maybe I should just quit and come home right soon so I know I can hear from you. Okay, let's listen to this one, Professor. Congratulations, Appalachia. Paladin Taggarty told me of your victory at Huntersville. I know it was costly, but future generations will thank you, as I am thanking you now. It makes me proud, but that's not why I'm calling. One of the Brotherhood's standing orders is being on the lookout for valuable technology, anything that would help us in our efforts. But as I look in every direction, I see chaos. The lights are out, and men have become little better than barbarians. Civilization 
Civilization is something I think of every day. <laughs> I know Lizzie is probably sick of the word by now. To rebuild that, to reclaim that, our successors are going to need the secrets of the past. And those secrets are in danger of slipping through our fingers forever. So far, our scribes have been tools to help protect our knights and maintain our bases. That needs to change. Brotherhood is going to be more than an army fighting force. We are going to be the guardians of civilization. So we have to grab every schematic, every holotape, every book, every goddamn note that holds the building blocks of the old world before it is too late. The scribes will hold on to them, preserve them, perhaps even progress beyond them. Nice. Protect them. Like a hard shell around a precious seed. One day when the time is right, that seed will grow, and a new civilization will be born. This, this is why we were born. Don't you see it? Helping your fellow man with a good goal, a soldier's goal. But this, we will be the catalyst that changes the world. I'm sure you have Paladin integrity is fully briefed. I have every faith in you, Appalachia. Elder Maxim, out. Okay. Appalachia online, Captain. I know most of you love America. Good old red, white, and blue. For those of us who served in Marabosa know something. America failed. Not because of its citizens. Lived clean lives filled with hardship in ending war. Certainly not because of its fighting men and women. God bless them. No. Its leaders failed us. Senators, generals, presidents, all those bastards. Their failure almost destroyed all mankind. But I look around here and I see survivors. People too stubborn damn ornery to die. We've fought and we've endured and we finally have a small path of safety. But having a home isn't enough. We need something more. What we need is purpose. We cannot look to the America of old for that purpose. We have to build our own. So tonight, as we break bread together, let us together something new something strong something we can be proud of something we can build upon we'll preserve what's best of what's come before us and use it and one day we will reclaim what was lost let us forge a brotherhood a steel Okay, that's quite interesting. Right, let's read some of these notes then what's lying around first before we start listening to anymore. That's Tommy. Knight Wilson says we're deploying tomorrow. Gra graduates early. Fort Fines needs manpower. Now apparently I know you don't approve of my decision to come here, but everyone's got the pro host deal wrong. They're an army of scorched in the bog. It's not lies. I've seen the scorched with my own eyes. You should come, we need you. It's hard to sleep knowing I'm heading in. Training one thing, but when fighting for real in days makes sense to me. Defiance is the old alley asylum. Lord knows we have to be crazy to go there. No, it won't mean anything to you, Tommy, but ad victorium for all sake, ad victorium. Well, we now know where the thingy is. Get inside the brotherhood steel thingy. Right, yo. Uh, this one. From now it could so, well, it's, it, I take full sense of squad bombings. That home, I make no excuses. I want to point out, however, that the operational screen prize was co covered twice during training. Be clear, the subject needs constant more emphasis. I will enjoy going forward to drill this into my cadets, calling me Ad Victorium. Let's listen to this old says log. Access to hardware? You'd think they'd be 
be ruling West Virginia by now. But they're gone. If they're following military logic, then they'll have a fortified headquarters somewhere. And a leader. Someone who knew what they were planning. Okay. Uh, about the Borough Hodge. Okay, Commander's Terminal. Personal notes. Squads and ranks. I've had a long talk with pilots entirely about the ranks of the Brotherhood, unlike most of the rest. I'm fine with them in general. Scribe, Knight, Elder, all respectable names, but Squires? Balmo told me what a Squire actually was. They were young, noble kids being trained to be knights one day. Calling a grown man or a woman Squire is just insulting. Actually, the argument was good. Paladin said Elder Maxim has some other ideas about renaming the ranks, but for now, his Lampio designate the changes they have already been made. Brohood. So right now, the Brohood is still, still hashing out changes. We need to train regime all the physical skills and still valid under my direction. Paladin Tari will con ugh, coordinate with Elder Maxim with regards to other training changes. Classes is understood, confused by me. Training starts. My father said I have never been an officer. Scorch like us now among. He was wrong. The, fun the funders have a hard time with what we saw at West Tech experienced FAV, but what's not going back? Even if we found a general, how could we take orders from now? Carl Roger Maxson is the end of the line. Chain of command established. I am coming around on the grand kid. He is another mouth to feed, but he's got us into West Tech and made sense of a lot of it. Lieutenant may be right about him. Once the camp's operation will be, be will commence daily duty logs. Saved reports. Texas Rogers. Since the Great War, this is the first train command I've issued, and it's designated. He didn't much like it when Mo found him, but Texas has the rest of. Never seen someone take two train like he did, especially for his age. With the sewer means all by Huntersville heating up. Had to save a week off basic for current class. No one did tax raise to the occasion, but he helped his squad through reconnaissance to Paladin Day that was fast tracked him for promotion. The man's a born leader, and his sense of touch in a T 51B that you can just can't teach. Kelly. So one sent a letter to. So one sent a letter to. I didn't know K. Kelly well. Well, all shot shows. Uh, Resentment seemed to be leading well, like. 
Hawker and found her body. Going through her facts seems like she lost a lot of kin. Close kin. Didn't look like it, but she was taking it hard. Give the woman full, a full of grave we left behind. I suppose I should be shocked. More soldiers didn't take the ease, easy way out. I hope the final mission treats you well, Kelly. Fisher. Uh, went AOL several understatements. One week before graduation, Fisher shown promise officer of watch report yesterday morning. A Fisher was missing, so one combat shotgun, ten boxes of shells, one salvage recon map, and other sunrise. He ripped us off. Tried to track him down, but lost him at the base of the satellite. I hope to God the raiders kill him. One higher trained army ranger with a special specialist in demolition. There are no words. Tomorrow, Tan and I are going to have a talk about our recruitment strategy. Hopefully she listens this time. Okay. First class duty logs. Uh, first one. It's been 29 days since Tan ordered ordered to Camp Venture online to fall, fall out our ranks. I honoured to report that we are fully operational. Had to improvise the regime with our airborne components, but everything else has been adapted. To ensure our survival, Tan needs to it's true soldiers, no mercenaries, no weak warriors, but cold blood killing machines. Busted at the seams with effect. The mansion girth that what I intend to give her. The best of the best. Log 2. Nine recruits signed to our venture the last month and two already quit. One of them re remaining six. It's my option that four of them are worthy to join the funder. Remain two were likely washouts before the end of the week. The only way to earn my respect here is to graduate. There are no prizes for second place. Third, regards to the fatalities, I'd like to state that while the recruiting passing was regretful, it wasn't a surprise with the initial training regime. Some breaking was and still is to be expected to prepare these recruits for the battle. I have them perform live firing exercises against hostile targets. It's the only way to ensure they are fully rife battle. I saw four requests to tidy to join us for the fallen recruits fear. Hopefully she can attend and we can put this tragedy behind us. Log three. As expected, we're down to four recruits. I'm getting pressure from Tidy to escalate training, but I'm going as fast as I can. She said she she wait until I can sell them ready. The obstacle is the lack of power, armor, parts, new recruits overworked the hydraulics which leaves the suits out of commission until they are replaced. I asked for replacements for Tyrese, saving them for the soldiers in the field. For now, I just have to make do with what they have. Nuffrey, please report the first class has graduated and have joined Tagri Funder. I'm saying that they are proved to be worthy soldiers and honor the ideals set forth by Lieutenant and Captain Roy Mason. As word spread, they're seeking soldiers and new recruits show a camp venture. They get to learn they are the funder has to offer and some are ex-military perhaps learn to reallocate that sense of structure they lost after the bombs. Perhaps in a few years we can ourselves an army. That would be a hell of a thing. So that's all their notes on there. So let's see about this one. Archives. March roster. Okay, there's some names there. Schedule. Week 1. Uh... Okay, so this is just about building shell as cleaning. We two, sack same thing, fire and the rest. I think this is like all the old terminals. So yeah, this is just going over daily activities and the rest. Personal notes, group assignment. Next group I'm about to take on mostly free state members plus stragglers. Time to whip up these kids and ship. Maybe you convince those few who haven't seen the light of days yet. Riz says he wants my best, so I aim to please these kids. Won't find any mercy in my camp. As Ames, I don't normally commit or just strangle a train, but I Ames is just something else. Apparently, she got a Voltec University medical education on top of her. She has knowledge about Appalachia's floor and floor. She knows how to wear around firearms, how to dress a deer, deer, and uh, even has a couple wrestling moves up her sleeve. It thinks we going down. She says her bunker is the first place I'm heading. Should anything come to me, hell, I make some excuse to get locked in with her and her family if I won't upset their supply balance. Bunker deployment. I'm debating if I should go into a bunker deployment during these camps. Suppose it wouldn't hurt to show what the space would be like. I could take them to mine but I'm not about to give up the location. I hear some of the free states have their share of problems with locals trying to sabotage their efforts. No my luck, they'll bother me. I put up a few fellows in hospital and no one wants that. 
Okay. I think there's a key in, the, in that locked locker for the thing. That's now night time. Uh, where's that locked locker? Here it is. Let's break into this and get the key. Oh, I believe this is where the key was. Damn. I'm useless at lockpicking still. Yep. Alright, let's go into the basement then and see what we can find inside that basement. First, let's get our power armor. And let's go and run around. So we'll head into the Cranberry Bog, people. The most dangerous place in Appalachia. Then we'll head over, we'll start making our way to Camp Venture. So what I might do in this video, because we haven't got much time left, is explore around here a little. Then I'll probably teleport over to here. Then take a walk down there in the next video and see what's around here. So that'll probably be my plan for the next idea. But there is something over that way as well. So we'll have to do that as well. But we'll get there eventually. But this is the big mountain. Oh. What's attacking me? You are. Go away. Ah, uh, not much. So this is the basement. Thunder Mountain. Okay. Relics. Bottle caps. Sealed. Oh, sealed wonder glue duct tape. Yep. Oh, there's no mod there. Spiked. Okay. Don't want that is. That might be for something later on. Someone's already been into the armory, as I can tell, and took everything. Alright. Command sent a password. We'll take that, that might be useful some for some things. Alright. And the key. Right, this whole transmission has changed some again. You stood by for you appreciate the update. In the past, information patrols was cleared through combat performance chems. The usage rate was now 100 sent but now half the time or more the chems are returned afterwards there are other stuff to you here a lot more sometimes i was expensive than new rules but people just seem happier i think it's the sense of purpose we know we're going to somewhere else that's planned for day so i think we're just loving this new pack now you can see i know i had a good new okay let's continue out here then shall we Uh, I'm getting boxed in by all these shelves. Right. So let's head down that way, shall we? Yeah, there's sunk down here. There's sunk there. See, there's stuff here. So we'll go here. But we are going to have to backtrack anyway, guys. Because there's sunk over here. We need to grab as well. We are just going to run from Scorch Beasts as well quite a lot. Just to let you know. There's uh, something down there near grab as well, so we'll head over that way as we're going. Oh, am I being attacked? No, I just gained red health for some reason. Oh, there's a ditch there. Okay, that turret defense system went mad on while we was here. To the mini nuke. Because uh, if any enemies come, I guess they'll just be terminated instantly. So these are some of the military encampments. Uh, there's a scorch beast over there. The dead soldiers. So yeah, this is one of the little fire bases we can find around. And this one's still all made, so I'm going to terminate anything that comes near it. Oh, and there's some power armor here. Anything of use? Nope. Okay. We'll head over to this building next. And then there's sunk. There's one look well there's two locations left in the mire. One we're gonna go to later on. And one we need to discover. So we'll head to the other one when we get there. For now let's continue next one. We'll do Vault Tech Universe uh, this Rob Core building later on. But for now I will do this. Miscellaneous search general steakhouse for supplies. Cool a new little quest to do while we're here. Seems like a nice easy idea. Bourbon, moonshine, cotton, wild water. Oh, there's a giant rat trying to eat me. There is a couple of gnomes. 
what's always interesting. Anything in the basement? Chains, okay. Let's go inside then. Oh. Chains? Is every door chained? Shut. Hmm. That may be shot at. Oh no, well, I'm just trying to find a way in. Right, we're in. Oh, this says it's super mutant infested place again. Hey, let's have a look. Oh, goodbye. Let's listen to hey, that, even though we're getting shot at. Okay, that's an interesting hollow tape. And we're just dealing with some super mutants, of course. So what else do we not like? Then it's good old super mutants. So this is a weird little steakhouse, I can say that, guys. Very weirdly shaped building. Now let's bring it to this one if we can. Damn. I break the bobby pin straight away. Come on, let's try and break into this building. Damn. I can never get these hard ones or these ones. That's why I prefer mods will allow you just to shoot the locks off. There we go. Ooh, it was well worth it. Cap stash. Okay, let's read this. Five Star General. Five Star General, a postpartum clone review by General Rooms. Bring one of the very few fine dining establishments in Appalachia as General Steakhouse was always a treat to visit, even after the restaurant was forced to change its menu due to soldiers of quality beef. Restaurant prior Mallow did an expert job crafting down to earth food. Must admit, though, I never cared much for the General's plank. Too much uptight tech types from Rob Cole trying to one up each other on. Unfortunately, these days the steakhouse attends a more pleasant, less prompt crowd. It's like the shaved restaurant. Okay. Oh, there's a ball cap there. Right, let's try and break into this one then, shall we? Oh, we did. Rob Cole customers. All staff should be extra priorities to any customers that come in from Rob Cole Research Center. They make up for more than half our clerk during the week. Manifesto in the basement. I put all the copies of the nutcase thingies in the basement like you asked. You shouldn't. Safe controls, remote door control. Okay. Let's get to search in this building then. Main hall. So this is the downstairs main hall area. So it's like it's just a now it's super mutant filled death trap basically. This is one of the few doors will lead to the outside. Yeah. Uh, anything here? Nope, but there is the basement, so we'll head down there. Head down there in a minute once we go through to the General's Dining Hall. Open that door so we can get out if we need to. Oh, there's no note here. 
to find some mission reports. Crab made a run for the trenches, but a scorch spotted him. He made it into the trenches without. We thought he was good, but then the scorch came. Our first few there mobbed, then he put up a good fight. Found a lone farmer hiding deep into a cave who he knows about the brothers to undefined. Said that the finds was fought to find. There was some epic place deep in the bog. He said the brotherhood was dead. Said they were all we would be all dead soon. Give him some rations and left. Been hugging the trenches more since the scorched. I've even seen s flying in the sky. No sign of the life ex except scorched in the distance. But talk was not too far now. Turn back, Alda. Alda is pissed, but Raji wants to know more about the Brotherhood's distress message. He can find it himself. Scorched on the trail, setting up some s makes it back. Do these bastards even get tried? Fuck anyone reading this. Finding something, tell them the Brotherhood is dead. Tell them the finds was keeping the lid on things. They're coming. I won't be one of those. Okay. Nice to know. So this was the general's dining hall before I've quite basically died in here. A alcohol, I think it still doesn't look like it, but we'll to Salisbury steak. Alright, let's go back around and let's go into the basement, then we'll head upstairs. So this looks like it's one of the toilets. Yep. Oh, so that's males, that's females, okay. Oh, some dead person on the loo. Kitchen area. Alright, we've got some water. Oh, there's a note here. Recipe. Oh, it's actually a recipe, okay. Uh, let's keep looking around then. Might as well find some food and water. Purified wall rag stack meats. I know that one. Free with Torah, free with Torah, free with Torah. Okay. Wait, wait. Well, you just leave me alone, buddy. I was trying to read a note there, and then you just come out of nowhere and attack me with a sledgehammer. Not very nice to do to someone. Right, so what is this free with Torga? We toiled in their fields, we let them. Okay, so this is something about free with Torga. I guess we'll learn more about that when we go I'm not going to try and read all that because that's a very complicated, nonsense message. I shall well try and read it in a minute. <laughs> Let's try and break into this first floor. There we go. Broken in. Duct tape. Alright, so free with Toga. So we child in their fields. They left us stray. We filed their coffee with gold. They filled our lungs with sludge. We broke our backs. They break our hearts. We told them our pain. They hooked us up on their pain because we voted. They stole our elections. Will you go away? I always get to read more of these notes I get attacked. Uh, elections. They I swear they bled us dry. We commit workplace. They took our jobs away. We wanted normal lives. They foreclosed our American dream. We were friends. They made us suspicious of our neighbors. We organized. They sent us to die in foreign countries. They reclaimed their own. We were tired. They're proud flares of real women and men. They hide behind ties, can butlers and plastic flares. We we want a world lived in by men. They want a graveyard patrolled by robots. It's time we unite to overthrow them and their soulless machines. Vitora belongs to, to we the people. Free Vitora's people party. Hmm, that sounds like communism to the military in Appalachia. Guess they're all going to be rounded up and shot up in prison for being communists. Oh well, let's try and break into this one then. Oh no, don't break the bobby pin, that wasn't sensible. Damn, I just keep breaking. I'm running with bobby pins as well. There we go. Ice machines, that was a worthwhile break into. So I've now got an ice machine. Uh, recipe and an ice machine. Maybe at least my cams get a little bit more decorated. Right, let's go upstairs and get the rest of these supplies then. Uh, so up here there's more like little rooms and the rest. Some materials. 
crossbow bolt fancy that snacks yeah there's a minigun on the table, I'm not going to bother taking it like much. That's one hell of a place to put a minigun, I guess. Fusion call. I will take that, though. Always very helpful. More dead muties. Uh, looks to be a patio area. Also, we can get on the roof as well. Yes, we can, so that's helpful. Oh, no. Who would ever guess there was a mutant up here? Right. Caps. And that's the quest complete. I got nothing for doing that little quest thing. Okay. Random. By the way, we need to head back on this road and head into the marshland quickly. So we can go and check out that area. But I'm just checking something. So I might try and get here and there and there. When we get back to this area, just to see what there is and try and get past the little areas. But for now, we need to head back into the Maya region. Just so I can discover this little building. There isn't really much in this building, I just want to discover it because we're covering everywhere in Appalachia as we go. And once we cover everywhere, that's going to be pretty darn cool. We've got plenty of quests to do as well, so that's always good. Oh, hello, ghoul. That's why I stay down. And I automatically know where this key is because I remember it off by heart due to the fact that I had to spend hours looking for it somewhere on here. Yep, there we go. Broadcast station key. I will. Oh, there's a Wendy go here. Will you just shut up? Do not have to scream my face to the cannibal? I just launched him into the trailer, apparently. You know, I don't even know where I launched him. But, oh, there he is. Caps, boost cell, Molotov, Rad X. When to go to fabric with that. Yep, thank you. And to get inside, we need to go around the other way. Oh, are you? Leave me alone. But I will take the caps off you. Actually, while I'm here, I will scrap all the junk. So that's always helpful. Uh, there we go. And this is just like a little stash room full of different little bits and bobs as you can see. Not much here, but a few little supplies. And a terminal. Let's have a look at this terminal. A conspiracy. Once again, the power that has been filled in allowed speech to flow freely in the public square. Note, Mothman. Excellent Baftas and alleged us was detained. The ability to speak on college campus, though the site disputes over research how in their travel and books being filled, raised barged by the state. State decided that the research was non scientific and not worthy pursuing depth, not giving a chance to peer review true science of biology, know what the math man is worth pursuing, and will you meaningful results despite the best efforts of the state. Okay. Crazy person, possibly. Let's try and bring to this one then. There we go. Ah, nothing. Okay, let's, I'm just going to teleport back to this one for quickness. And then I'm going to run to there, but let me just turn around and check my strategy guide. Right, I've got a little idea of what I need to do. So that's good. At least I know where I'm going now. So yes, we've got a few places just to discover and look around and see what's happening. So right, there is something over this way apparently. Yes, I see it on my map. Also, we may get attacked by Scorch Beasts because we are going to be approaching a fish site very closely soon. 
So that's always interesting to know. Yep, I. Oh no, it's a car bar. I thought that was a thingy. But no, it's just a cargo bar. Hello, buddy. Come on, attack me for no reason. Whoa, you just teleport again. I don't like that. Stay away. So this is someone's farm. Right, there's a farmhouse here. There's a holotape here. This is Enola Walker. Ha, huh, cool, I might try and get a picture of them doing that. So that looks pretty cool. What a nice pose. Nah, let's wait till they do it again. Let's do heroic. Hopefully they don't get attacked-ish. Yeah, here we go. I'm just going to check that picture and make sure I did okay. Because I think that might be a funny thumbnail for today's one where I'm just getting rained on. Yeah, that looks like a pretty funny one. Stand there, it's raining down and stuff. Let's just have a look. Uh, I see we're trying to head to this little house and we'll turn around and head to the fisher site, I would say. God, we are being gassed a bit by these plants, whatever they are. Oh god, this place, this place I've always had nightmares with because somehow I take extreme health damage instantly. I never know why. Come on. Alright, they're both dead. I know there's a lot of rads around here now and then. And also these creatures do not want to die. Come on. Whoa, that's a legendary one. That's three stars. Hell yeah, man. We're taking that one on. Where is he? Come here. I want your body. What do you have on you? Hunter's Ripper. What's that do? Oh, before we send down channels. I'll trade it into the new legendary vendor when that comes out. Seems like a nice sensible place. What's this? Watoga High School. Don't take shipments out to Watoga High School anymore. Those... Protect drone cops try to scan the crates last time. Good thing they run s so slow. They told spot brats that if they want their moonshine, they need to come and get themselves. Yeah, I would as well. Sounds a bit dangerous if bots are scanning your materials. You don't want to be caught. So we've got some dead person up there. Uh, Right. Let me 
there's nothing more here. Oh, well, this one block fly is now dead. Well, not block fly, infected blood bug. Right, so if we've just done that, right, there's a thingy quest there where I don't really want to do. So I'm just going to ignore that for now, I'm going to run towards the Scorch site. Then from the Scorch site, we're going to run towards a military encampment. There is a ton of super mutants here. And a few dead bears, so we're just going to run past all these. Oh, Jesus. No spamming that min minigun like there's no tomorrow. Try and find the Scorch Beast super mutant. Might be more fun. Right, now here comes the dangerous operation. Oh god, have mercy on my soul. Run! Yep, she's spot me. Gas attack instantly. Wah. Wah. That's a nice big sonic attack lady. Now I've just got to watch all these holes in the ground. So I don't fall down one. Fish aside to squad. Right, let's run. Get to our military camp. Hopefully the air defense system will be operational there. If not, we're pretty much screwed, I would say. Keep running, keep running. I know if we, I've just gone over the zero, zero, my clock's just hit zero, zero, so that means we've done 55 minutes of recording, I think. I'm just going to check, so I am still recording, and my voice is being picked up still, so yes, that's all fine. Damn, the air defense systems are dead. That's not a good sign. And there's a ton of more miners. <laughs> this is just going to turn into one big firefight. Oh, come on, leave me alone. Do they just fire a ton of rockets everywhere? Oh. This is, this is how dangerous it gets, guys. Oh, here. Yeah. Just try to grab ammunition and anything I can while taking heavy direct fire. Alright, let's tell us more of that. Right, let's take out you guys. So you're the leader of this little rebelish pack. Oh, smack you in the face. They're supposed to be attacking the mole miners. Scorch, stop working together. It's not nice when you do that. Right, so, whew, that was hard work. Right, so we have discovered that, 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 and that. I'm just going to check my strategy guide. There is this mine to discover, but I think there's a quest to relate with that. I'm not sure. But right, we'll go there, then we'll head down here in the next video, then we'll head down to this location here next, so we can get there. So basically it's going to be there, 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 then it'll be straight down to Fort Defiance after that. So I'm going to head to the mine, save it there, and then we'll continue on in the next video by exploring that mine and heading down to the other locations. Hey, at least we survived and got away from that fissure site. Oof, that was a bit dangerous. Yeah, you keep flying around your fissure site, Scorched. Leave me alone. Right. So what's this mine called? Calm wood mine. And there's some, of course there's some ghouls here. And some ants. There we go. Down with it. But I'm going to jump on here just in case there's any enemies trying to attack me while I do my outro. You never know. But yeah, anyway guys, if you like this video, give it that nice thumbs up. If you didn't like, give it that thumbs down. If you have any questions at all about this video or any of our videos, guys, put them in the comments below and I'll try and answer the best of my ability I can, guys. But until next time, I am Victor Barisov, signing off. Until next time, guys. Bye.